It's time for Super Bowl Heroes presented by Verizon. Heroes always emerge in the big game. Last year was Nick Foles and we're just a couple days away to find out who will be the hero of Super Bowl 53. Now let's send it over to the heroes of CBS Sports HQ. The city of Atlanta hosting another Super Bowl. Last time was in 2000. Super Bowl 34 between the Rams and Titans, a different venue though. Pete Prisco, a young buck at the time, he was there. What, a mere 64 years old? What about a flashback Friday with Pete Prisco, Jamie Eisenberg, and Chris Hassel? Gentlemen, take it away. Pete is uh, is covering his 29th Super Bowl, right? You got Correct. 30 next year. Tommy's taking shots at me. Yeah, well, he? now that he's now that he's back at home base, yeah, he, he would have done safe. that when he was here. No, would he? no, he no, would not he's have. Safe. Uh, they arm wrestled beforehand to see who gets to pick the hero first. Pete won, so Pete. There's who no is, chance. Who is your Super oh, yeah. Bowl hero? Who is my Super Bowl yeah, hero? Yeah, for this, this Super game? Bowl. Yeah. Well, and for a lot of the games, Tom Brady. Uh, look, you can't go against Tom Brady in this type of game. He will make it. Look, Sony Michelle is going to have a big day. I think they're going to be good on offense. But in the end, they're going to have the ball late. And they're going to be down. And Tom Brady's going to get the football. And he's going to go drive the team, not to a field goal. He's going to go get a touchdown to win the game. And everybody's going to go, Tom Brady has finest. He's the MVP. He's my Super Bowl hero. Well, of the five wins that they have, he's been the Super Bowl MVP in four of them. So that's a pretty, that's a, that's a I smart chalk. Pick. That's I what chalk. we call it chalk. Is, chalk. Chalk. Yeah, chalk. I like chalk. chalk. I'm yeah. going Sonny Michel. Uh, Pete said it. Um, I think actually I won because he wanted Sonny Michel, so I won the arm wrestling uh, in that regard, which I will win. We'll arm wrestle after this. No. Uh, we'll, we'll, we'll do that for we'll social. Um, <laughs> Sonny Michel is going to have a dominant game. Look, he's, uh, first off, Georgia kid. You know, he's playing in his home state. Um, Good point. You look at what uh, he's done the last two games, over 100 yards rushing, five in each game, five total touchdowns. Last time a running back has had five total touchdowns in the playoffs going into the Super Bowl. Terrell Davis, so uh, he's in good company there. You just look at what the, the, the game plan is. The word of the week has been wham. That's right. They're going to try and wham Aaron Donald and try and slow him down. The way you slow down an elite pass rusher in the middle is you run at him. And so I think you'll see Sonny Michelle be a big part of this passing game. James Devlin, unsung hero. He's not the hero. He's the unsung okay. hero because that's going to be the guy leading him through the line. You're going to see a big, big day from Sonny Michelle. I think he's going to have the biggest impact on this game. Okay, so both these guys obviously like the New England Patriots to win. Heroes uh, Tom Brady from Pete Prisco, Sonny Michelle from Jamie Eisenberg. I do want to point out, though, that Bryant McFadden had a write-in vote, and he says his hero is going to be Jared Goff, so he believes the Rams are going to win that's this That's why we kicked him off. Get out of here. <laughs> out, out. Tommy, back to you. All right, guys, thank you very much. Who will be the hero on Sunday? Patriots, been here before. This version of the Rams, neophytes, except for a handful of guys, including C.J. Anderson, who we had on set earlier in the week. Super Bowl 53 on CBS.